So I just got down with my grandparents. I'm heading over to pick up Chelsea to go out for a late lunch, early dinner, and an amazing thing happened. I got a new iPhone. 3G, yeah, to a 5S, baby. I'm really stoked. It's really beautiful. Um, I didn't know what I was missing, actually. It sends text messages, like, faster than the speed of sound or light, whatever's faster. I mean, it is, oh God, it's beautiful. Slick, the camera, oh, gorgeous. I'm so stoked. I wanna play with it, but I'm driving. I'm not driving, I mean, no, what? Monica's car is evil. It locks. And you can't go anywhere. But she just finds you already do all this. I did really quick, but I didn't do like anything special. I just she, like, I got a new phone. she has had the iPhone 3 for four years. Yeah. Since it came out. And finally today she joined the rest of the human race with her iPhone 5S. But then her case was cuter than mine. <laughs> So I had to go shopping. I still think I like yours better. We might have to trade. Nope. Later. Nope. And so I went and got a Batman case. I put a new voice on my Siri. Hello, Siri. Hi there, princess. <laughs> Popcorn! No. Flappy Bird! <laughs> You have an iPhone 5, yeah. Oh wait, my bird's orange again. I told you the birds change colors. They forever catch. Yeah. Oh, 10. Shh, relax. Are you at 14? What is this? <laughs> Got our popcorn. Popcorn! And now we're gonna find a movie. We just watched Safety Not Guaranteed with uh, Aubrey Plaza. It was actually really cute, so now we're gonna find something else to watch. I liked it, it was cute. So her goal was to get to 15, and she did with the help of this wonderful song, Half Moon Run. The rhythms, they're getting me through, man. <laughs> oh. Okay, I got to 15, that was my goal. I just got 23. <laughs> so, <laughs> we were getting our in and out. And the guy at the window, Monica, throws me under the bus. She's like, yeah, she won't talk to you because she's too busy playing Flappy Bird. <laughs> and he's like, oh, my girlfriend just got me that app. So while we were waiting for our food, we bump. had like, bump. <laughs> we had like a five minute conversation with the guy at the window about Flappy Bird without me making eye contact once because, you know, I got to play. <laughs> and, uh, and so our departing, he goes, good luck with your Flappy Bird. <laughs> And I turn and I look at him and I go, no, sir. Good luck with your flappy. Can I break the rule and just go through here? Or do I have to go backwards? Um, well, seeing as there were like six popo behind us, <laughs> I'm going to say go backwards. Aww. Oh, so sorry. Aww. Oh, oh drop me the ah! So I'm going to show you what Chelsea looks like right now. You ready? No! I dropped a floppy bird. She's like caressing <laughs> all the in and out, but then playing the game at the same time. It's the only way to do it. I need to put this away, I'm driving. Oh, so, oh, I think we just discovered the only thing more depressing oh, no. than hitting an animal. <laughs> we had a possum run out in front of the street and Monica swerved and missed it. And we both turned <laughs> and watched the car behind us just <laughs> Farewell. I mean, they're Sir ugly, possum. But I feel bad. Someone's addicted to Flappy Birds. You can't film me playing Flappy Birds because I'll say bad things. <laughs>